Assalamu alaikum and welcome back to Step Up, the show to enable the young Muslima to step up in her deen. As a young Muslim, it is important to be involved in the community around us and be active in aiding others when we can. This is a part of what being a Muslima is all about. Today I meet an organisation that does exactly that, WAMI, which stands for World Assembly of Muslim Youth. It's a charity based in the UK which provides help to Muslim youth and aims to clear misconceptions about Islam. Let's find out more. Assalamu alaikum. I'm here today in Leicester Square take part in a youth orientated dawah event organised by WAMI. WAMI stands for the World Assembly of Muslim Youth and is a member of the UN NGOs and it served our community for more than 15 years. Today I'm here to talk to Amina and Khalid about what the organisation does and what this event is about. So what drew you to work with WAMI? Well, it's regarding the da'wah and to propagate the truth about Islam and to remove this confusion that most people have today. So that's why I joined them. Why do you think it's important for young people to get involved with organisations like WAMI? It's very important. I think it's a duty for every single Muslim to be involved in da'wah and to invite people to the truth. What activities do you think young people can get involved with in their own time? They can, you know, propagate the truth by uh, giving some Quran for free, check with their friends if they can take them to the masjid, the closest masjid, introduce them to Islam, and just to give them the right information. That's the main thing. And it's duty for every Muslim. We're doing an event today to remind people to look after the nature because uh, this is a, a plant, lavender. Yeah, it relaxes your mind. When you're stressed, uh, if you can't sleep, it makes you sleep. Oh, thank you very much. Okay. Thank you very much. We've just seen your amazing volunteers going up and down Leicester Square. So we're wondering how was WAMI formed and why was it formed? We do mostly our projects in the community the project that nobody has done before. And alhamdulillah for, for the past 24 or five years, we have done projects that uh, would benefit the community. For example, there was no scouts before. There was no dawah school, no dawah training course. Alhamdulillah, we started then. There was no dawah leaflet those days. So we produce good quality material. Alhamdulillah, everybody does it. Then we start doing unique projects, like today, the one you see, the nature one so that the other people will learn from it. And the aim of all these projects is to remove the misconception that the public has because we notice there is a lot of misunderstanding when we talk to the people in the town centre. And they really ask us where the Muslim community is, uh, why they're not coming out, why they're not sharing anything which benefits the community. Uh, because the, the public, the British public, they're very nice. They're very welcoming. I was in Birmingham. One lady, she gave me a handmade scarf because it was very cold. And she said to me, uh, when we were giving this lavender gift, she said to me, look, I've got lavender on my arm. And she said, look, you Muslim community, you care about nature. So I would like to give you a gift. See? And that, uh, the funny thing was that day it was freezing cold. And subhanAllah, Allah sent her to give me the scarf to put on. You see, you meet some really nice people. Alhamdulillah, what really makes me happy is that most of the volunteers that I get assistance, at least they're coming out, rather than 
staying at home, so we give them opportunity to come and present on the business side, you see, so they can express themselves. What is it? It's a lavender, uh, it's a plant, it relaxes your mind. Thank you. You are welcome. Take this as well. We're doing this event today to remind people to look after the nature. So Jazakallah Khair, for, brother, for coming here and, and speaking to us about the amazing stuff that Wami's been involved in. We really appreciate it. Jazakallah. As you have seen today, Alhamdulillah, it's been a very beneficial event. And it's important to remember that we need to tackle the misconceptions in Islam as well as spreading the beauty within the deen. The Ummah is extremely dependent on the youth and it's always been the young who have been at the forefront of furthering Islam. What a great job they're doing, mashallah. It's such a beautiful way to reach out to people by giving a free gift bag containing a beautiful message from Islam. And it's amazing how people respond to such a kind gesture, alhamdulillah.